Katherine Mahler. We're here for tips and tricks and today we're going to be talking about holding your bow and how important it is to be relaxed. That's one of the big things when you're playing the violin or the fiddle is that you need to be super relaxed. That will make it easier to play faster. It'll make it so that you don't get tired as easily and just it will uh, improve your longevity as far as being able to play your instrument for a long time. Uh, not only on a specific day, but, uh, you know, into old age as well. So, holding your bow. The big thing with holding your bow is to make sure that all of your fingers are nice and curved, that they're nice and relaxed, and your thumb should be nice and curved too. A lot of my students, you'll notice, well, I notice in lessons, a lot of my students their thumb kind of bends backwards this way and I call that a banana thumb and you don't want that because that creates tension all here through your arm. And a lot of times too I notice that my students are really grabbing onto the bow and holding on with all your might. Uh, and I like to think of my fingers as just guiding the bow. So I don't actually like to uh, call it a bow grip because that word is not good. We don't want to grip, we want to be really relaxed. So I always think of my fingers as just guiding the bow, trying to keep it straight, but really not doing a whole lot of work. So if you actually just shake out your hand and notice when it's all relaxed, see how curved those fingers are? That's what you want. You want your hand just to be nice and relaxed. The bow just slips in there. These two fingers sit sort of on the side. My thumb goes kind of across from that middle finger. Just tucks right in there, right next to the frog. My index finger wraps around and then my pinky sits on top and I'm hardly doing any work, really. That's the thing that I love. I do as little work as possible. So when I put my bow on the violin, my violin is holding the bow up, gravity's pushing the bow down. I don't have to do anything with these fingers in order to hold on to the bow. I'm just guiding it to try to keep it straight, but my violin holds the bow up, gravity pushes the bow down and there's not a lot left for me to do. So that is wonderful. So what you can do though, when you're getting ready to play, is just wiggle your index finger, tap these two middle ones, tap your pinky. If you tap all your fingers before you start playing, that'll make sure that you're nice and relaxed. And then as I say, being relaxed will help you to go faster, it'll help your bow not to bounce, it will just improve your enjoyment of playing the violin. So uh, just keep that in mind and enjoy a nice cup of tea and uh, have a lot of fun fiddling. I'll see you again next week.